B, C, D, E. It's like the freaking alphabet over here. Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Chelsea Smith, and I'm going to be sharing with you today all the vitamins, protein, BCAAs, everything that I'll be taking when I'm on this journey to getting shredded. I'm really serious about it this time, and I want to, if I'm successful, to have this for you so that you know what I've been doing over the course of the next six months. The reason I say six months is I don't think this is gonna happen overnight, but I definitely believe in myself and I think that I could do it in six months. So I'm gonna show you exactly what I'll be taking and how often. Some of the vitamins I am not gonna be taking every day. They're just, um, they're just something that I feel like I need a little bit more in my system. Some of it I've done research on, some of it I just feel like, I'm like, oh, this, is, this seems like a good thing to have. I'm gonna tell you a little bit about what the product does and then we'll see if all of this helps. Okay, so the first product I'm going to try is this BCAA Fruit Punch. Um, it's Best Aminos BPI Sports, and it's for muscle repair, it's for strength, endurance, power. I'm going to take before my workout. That's what the consensus is online, is that you should take it before your workout. So I don't know what it tastes like or anything yet, but um, I don't know, we'll see. I'll definitely give like a review of the products later on, but right now I just wanna show you what I'm actually using. I um, like to try out different protein powders because sometimes I feel like certain ones make me feel bulky, but I get like different ingredients out of each one. I just try to find one that has like really kind of low calories and just like a ton of protein, obviously. And I try to find one with like really low sugar. So this one has two grams of sugar and it's 110 calories. I feel like that's like a good designer way. I don't think it's, it's not like a nice, like super expensive protein, but it's like pretty good. The Bob's Red Hill Vanilla Protein Powder. It's not like my favorite taste, but it still again has like pretty low sugar. You can get whatever protein you want. That's just what I'm doing. So um, first I'm gonna go through all the vitamins that are kind of just like supporting your health. So um, obviously like, I do not like getting sick. I only got sick for like three days this entire year and I attribute that to just getting sleep, but I also think obviously vitamin C. So I've got vitamin C tablets, which I'll take like every three days. I don't feel like I need to like overload my body with tons of vitamins, but I definitely wanna like supplement my, you know, fruit intake or whatever. Um, so I got vitamin C and then I also just for the days that I just want a little extra kick um, I have this simple truth vitamin C crystal powder and this is really good for just like giving a little punch to like a fruit smoothie I don't really drink fruit smoothies that often, but you could even mix it in water and I just you know It's vegetarian gluten-free. I don't know basically. I'm gonna trade um, Like every every day do one of these three which this is not recommended by like doctors or I, I'm making this stuff up But I just want to see the helps so I'll do vitamin C one day. I'll do Vitamin E another day, which is cardiovascular health and then of course um, just some energy metabolism with the B12 and I don't know if it's gonna help to have like I just don't feel like I need it every single day like I feel like that's a little overkill I have a couple different fish oils. Um, this one I got in like a health package and um, I mean it's really hard because pills you don't really know like it doesn't, they don't taste like anything so it's hard to see like oh I feel so much better. I feel like the progress I'll make is gonna be a lot because of my eating and working out but just vitamins are just something just to add to like helping your body build muscle, cut the fat and you know, helping you sleep, helping you stay stay healthy. So um, I definitely have heard through and through that fish oil is really important. So I'm gonna do one of these every single day. I've got this, I think this is from Costco. I mean, it's just like basic, I feel like fish oil, it's like, how, how specific do you need your fish oil to be? Like, it's just like fish oil. So yeah, I'm gonna use all these up until I use them up and I'm gonna do this every single day. One thing that I love putting in my smoothie is just a little tad of like peanut butter powder instead of real peanut butter. It just has like less sugar. It's got four grams of protein, which you can always use more protein um, and only three grams of sugar. So it's different from like putting an actual scoop of peanut butter into your smoothie. But this one is just the chocolate PB Fit um, from Better Body Foods and I love it. It is so good, and I just put the tiniest a bit in my protein. I'm gonna start taking a multivitamin every single day. I have to make sure that mine doesn't have any iron in it because I have hemochromatosis, which 
it won't really affect me until I'm older and I'm like more prone to certain diseases, but I have to make sure that I don't get any extra iron because it's really not good for me. So I looked at this one, doesn't have any iron, but it has a lot of other stuff, which I mean, like this almost takes the place of like all those other pills that I'm taking besides the fish oil, but I really like to just make sure like I, I'm getting some good vitamins. So I guess I'll take, I could taste this. I'm trying to like not start any of this until January 1st, um, which by the time you see this video, it'll be like actually time to, ow, jeez. I'm gonna try one of these. Not bad, Walgreens. Something my brother actually recommended was this D3. Supports strong bones and immune, immune health. So I've never taken D3 before, but man, I got B, C, D, E. It's like the freaking alphabet over here. I have a couple of these and I'm gonna do these every single day. So if you guys follow along with me, you'll know that I have been really trying to grow out my hair and it's just not working and I've been having a lot of trouble. So I finally just chopped it off and just like wear extensions when I feel like it. But I was taking, obviously I took like most of these um, gummy vitamins and they're just like hair, skin, and nails. The only thing I noticed was that like my nails started growing faster, which is actually pretty annoying when you get your nails done all the time. <laughs> but it does have a lot of biotin and so I'll probably be taking this like occasionally too. I feel like I don't want to overload my body with like too many pills, but um, <laughs> obviously a lot of pills going on and gummies. So my favorite protein shake to make is number one, a decaf via packet. I just put it in hot water and then I put it in the freezer. I let it sit for like 15 minutes. I take it out, I put that in with ice, a scoop of protein powder, a little tiny scoop of the peanut butter powder, and then, um, what else did I put? Oh, and then I'll put some almond milk in there. Like you can just arrange however much you want. I don't really have exact measurements. I just kind of pour it in until it tastes good. And then I use the bullet, which is super good and super quick. And also I like the fact that the bullet's easy to clean. It's like you can just wash it out really quick compared to like, I feel like blenders are a little bit more intense to clean. I will just usually do a protein shake after a workout. I don't really like to do protein every day because I get bulky really fast and that's something I'm gonna have to be careful of when I'm doing all this working out is I just get bulky and um, I wanna slim down. So um, my brother has helped me out with a couple different workouts that I'm gonna be doing, which uh, if you wanna see the workouts that I'll be doing, um, just click on this video right here. These are the workouts that I will be doing. If I'm successful, I want you to have seen exactly where I started and what I needed to do to get to where I am by the end of the year. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure that you like and subscribe. And if you have any comments and you think that any of these things I'm doing are completely wrong, go ahead and tell me in the comments because I am not an expert. I literally just, um, I just, have been listening to different people. I'm gonna get one of those big pill boxes and like set them all out so that I could just pop them in the next day. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys later.